All of our deco fire pits come equipped with the lava rock that you'll need to act as a barrier before you put your decorative stone on top. So depending on the model you chose, you will have enough lava rock just to apply to the outer layer of the burner as well as the burner pan. Naturally, lava rock tends to be a little bit of a dustier stone, so in order to keep everything nice and clean, we recommend just blowing off the excess dust or rinsing it down before placing it on the fire pit, but just make sure that everything's dry before you set it up. Once you've prepped your lava rock, you're ready to place everything on the burner pan and the surrounding area of your fire pit. You just wanna create an even layer so it acts as a barrier for your decorative stone. This is what your fire pit should look like once your lava rock is in place. Now you're ready for your decorative stone, let's get started. Just like your lava rock, you're gonna wanna apply the decorative stone to the surface of your fire pit in an even layer, taking in mind not to cover the burner too much as you want the most optimal burn. Once you have all of your decorative stone on top in your even layer, you are gonna wanna rearrange a couple of the stones just to get the most efficient burn. All right, so you've made it to the end of the video. Your fire pit has been connected to the fuel source. Your rocks are in place. All of our deco fire pits come standard with a manual ignition burner, so you'll have a chrome key included with the package when you receive it. If you went for the electronic ignition burner, you'll just have an on-off remote. Now for the fun part, let's fire it up. 